Well, ladies and gentlemen, as Bunny says, welcome back for another edition of Minecraft. Thank you for joining me. Um, the last time I was playing, I was building something. I was building up a, an area that was going to be a portal to the nether. Uh, I'll show it to you. I ended up uh, as a peer. We know about that. But I went and I started building this. It's a giant pedestal here. I don't know how well you could see it in the video. But I built up an entire uh, column here that reaches all the way up. And I figured I'd go the whole route. And I made a whole thing here. And I made it so I could, I'm going to put in the obsidian here and make the actual portal. And I went ahead of time and I put a chest there so I could put all my stuff in it. And uh, I'm going to jump into the nether <laughs> from here and I want to see what happens. Now, hopefully this is enough. Now, I went around and I realized I was going to go into the nether and I was like, well, I need diamond stuff, so I don't want to take my enchanted stuff with me. I wanted re regular diamond stuff, so I I ended up going into uh, um, uh, the cave system I have in there, and I was running around it. And I ran around it for like four hours. I didn't even I didn't even think about it, but I was I could have I should have recorded some of it, but. Uh, Because I was just trying to get enough, uh, some diamond, in order to, you know, to have the diamond, uh, to make just a set of armor. And it was taking a while, because it didn't, I couldn't find any. I was so surprised. <laughs> oh, wow, really? Get out of here. <laughs> this octopus thing. Now, I wanted it, the, uh, portal sort of in the water so I could pull a boat up right to here. So I wanted to make sure I was one square in the water. Do I even have the flint and steel? Yes, I do. Okay. There we go. I want to throw up a couple of squares there. Um, and you know what I saw? I was watching something and I saw a guy who got stuck in another because... because uh, one of the creatures had blew up his portal on the other side, and he didn't have flint and steel with him. And he couldn't get back, because he couldn't relight the uh, portal. <clears throat> and I was like, oh my god, really? I didn't even think about that. So uh, I'm going to make a box and stick it near. When I go through the portal, I'm going to stick a box, a chest, and make sure... I have, um, everything's okay. Um, uh, yeah, let me see, what am I going to use here? Yeah, polished granite. Uh, so let me grab some wood first. Doesn't matter what wood, I'm just making a chest out of it. And then I throw it down as soon as I get in. Um, so that, uh, did it, I do it, what did I just do it? Did I leave the flint and steel on the box there? Or, hold on. <laughs> just make sure. Okay, yeah, I did. All right. Let me just do this real quick, and, uh... Oh, wow. I didn't realize it makes that creepy noise like that. It's sort of a noise. It's really strange.
Yeah, I want to keep it like that. Maybe I should have used this. Actually, you know what? I think I do. This is a polished, uh, you know what? Yeah. Let me go back and grab that real quick. I've been a little sick the last couple of days. So I've been having a little trouble getting some videos out. Oh, my voice doesn't sound too bad. It might be a little scratchy, so please put up with it. It might be a little scratchy than the normal, that is. Um, there we go. Ooh, no, 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 no. Okay. Um, there we go. That's right. Yeah, I think it, yeah. Okay, yeah, I'll do that. I'll have to put a flint and steel in the other one too. The other portal. Uh, well, assuming that they send me to different... I don't know if they'll send me to a different place. Okay, let me... Alright, let me start... Switching out my armor here. And I have a regular bow as well. I should have brought a... Yeah, you know what? I should have probably brought, um... You know, I need a crafting table. Uh... I should have probably brought... Yeah, I need a sword. Yeah, I'm going to have to get a sword here and a silk. I was thinking a silk pickaxe. Oh, well, let me grab that. In case I want to get some of the uh, the yellow uh, gemstone stuff for it. No. Do I have a silk pickaxe? I'm not even sure. Okay. Well. Quickly make a crafting table here for myself and um, make a cheap sword. Actually, I, I'll, make, I'll make an iron sword. Why am I? I plenty of iron. Do you even have diamond? Yeah, I do. Actually, I'll make a diamond one. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. as well. Uh, if I plan on going fighting or something like that, then I'll... This is just for defensive stuff. I just want to have something to protect myself just in case something is not attacking me. Um, and I've been up arrows. At some point I'll have to make some more arrows to put into the chest, but... Yeah, that's it. Okay. Uh, yeah, let me go to sleep and then... I'm going to get going. Uh, I'm going to go into the nether. So, you can see I'm trying to avoid it. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to, uh, oh man, look, it's just sitting there, right out the window. I wanted to make sure I could look out the window, especially from my bedroom here, and just see it floating there on the, on the pedestal. I thought it would be sort of cool. Yeah, oh, I didn't hear a spider. Is there a spider on the roof or something? Or what's going on here? Yeah, I can hear one. Is he in here? Is he down here? Is there a spider down there? No, I guess not. Okay. Well, there it is. So, alright, let's get going. I'm having a hard time moving in the water. I keep forgetting that I had the, you know, the enchanted stuff on, and now I'm, like, moving really slow in the water and stuff. 
Okay, let's see how this works. All right, goodbye, crew world. Let's head for the nether. It's just so intimidating. <laughs> okay, all right, me. All right, let's do it. Wow. Okay, that's weird. What a weird sort of spot. Okay. Is, uh, where am I compared to? Oh, okay, here it is. Here's my other gate. I'm way over here. Alright, let me put down my, uh, let me put down the chest over here. I don't want it too close to the gate because I don't want it getting exploded or something. You know, actually, you know what? Yeah, let me let me put it right here. Quickly put down the chest. Oop. And yeah, I want to protect it, so I'm gonna put something up like that. Put up a torch there. Make sure we have the flint and steel. Okay, I think I'm doing alright. Let me look and see where... Okay, that's the fortress over there. Really creepy fortress I didn't like. Okay, let's... Let's, let's get to work. Nope. What is, what is down here? Okay, I don't like this. Oh well, magma. All right, let me. Already, I'm already blocking stuff up. Really? Okay. And okay, that's it. Yeah. All right. Let me. You know what? Let me start digging around this thing first of all. The, uh, the portal itself. Creepy noise. Reminds me of the Twilight Zone. All right, more adventures in the Nether. In the Nether. <laughs> oh, some. Oh, that's some odd stuff, huh? Can I? Oh, I can. Okay. The slow sand, or whatever it is. You know, I didn't realize I could pick it up that easy with, uh, with just your hands. I thought you had to use a special axe. I mean, a pickaxe. Okay, let me just make a nice little space here. Hopefully one of those stupid big headed things don't appear and start shooting fireballs at me. I hate those things. They always creep me out, they always scare the crap out of me. They make weird noises and everything, I don't like them. Okay, I don't want to there's enough space. I'm going to only do this wall here and that should be it. Oh, is it? Is it him? Or is that the pigman? Okay, they're a tiny bit loud. I'm going to turn the sound down just a little bit. You know, I adjusted the sound, um, And I turned up the the blocks and stuff, so it would be the same noise. So you could hear the actual blocks being uh, mined and all that. 
but um, you can still hear stuff like uh, I think the it was something I thought hostile creatures would be the creatures and the ambient noise would be like opening and closing doors and stuff like that but it seems to be the um, blocks seem to have to do with the certain certain stuff that I th thought would for sure would be ambient noise because it would be considered ambient noise but and I think the creatures too have to do uh, I don't know I'm not sure how the sound works in this game seem to have its own logic okay I think I will do this ceiling part right here oh okay one minute Ooh. no 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 oh 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 wait oh okay <laughs> all right hold on uh, this, this should be easy enough to fix. Hold on, let me. I forgot how easy it is for. Uh, there we go. Okay, well, you know what? I guess. I guess not. Uh, let's keep the sailing the way it is. I guess. The, uh, let's just do that. Hold on. There we go. Okay, I get that's it. That's it, I guess for the. Oh, you know what I should do is put up a, a wall here. So when I come out there, I'm not getting immediately attacked. Yeah, that's it. Okay, <laughs> here we go. At the very least, I could hide behind the wall. Something starts attacking me. Just want a nice double thickness here. That's it. Okay. And oh wait, wait. You know what I need to do is put down a a waypoint, and I'll put down gate two. Call it gate two. Oh no, new waypoint. There we go. There we go. one gate okay good and that's good for there um what's going on over here it's magma okay I'll start okay let me just start doing this here anyway I was feeling a little ill and uh So I took a little bit of time for myself, and I started, you know, recently I just started listening to somebody do a, um, I went back and started listening to some of my old, um, some of the old, uh, things I had, like, I, I listened to this one woman who was doing, sometimes, every once in a while I listened to her, she was doing a, 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 a let's play of Fallout 3, uh, I think I mentioned it before, she's this German woman who, unfortunately had throat cancer, yeah, and she's no longer on, uh, tongue cancer actually, uh, And uh, pretty obvious, you stopped doing stopped doing let's plays and stuff. And uh, I really liked the Fallout Three that she did. She liked to seem to like have a lot of fun doing like um, playing like a sort of sneak thief. She seems to like like sneaking games because she loved, she loved Thief and uh, she did let's plays of like Thief and. Some other stuff. 
which coincidentally I worked on a little bit. I didn't uh, fully work on it. I, I, I wasn't a programmer or anything. I worked on Thief a little bit back when it originally came out. Uh, I was doing testing for it. Her name is, oh, her name is, um, well, you know, again, she's not on anymore, but I hope her channel doesn't disappear. I might, you know what, I might, actually, now that I think about it, maybe I'll download it to her. Maybe I'll do something and download all her follow through Let's Play, because I don't want it to disappear on me. But I do listen to it every once in a while. Her name is Letha, Letha Juliana. And uh, she would do a Let's Sneak. Yeah, I've, I'm sure I've mentioned it before. She would do a thing called Let's Sneak. Her Let's Play, you know, her thing was she would, you know, do Let's Sneak. Same way that I was originally going to call my channel Let's Cheat. <laughs> you know. Uh, let's cheat our butts off. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I just my the idea my idea was to just have a long let's play of just me just getting rid of the sort of boring parts of the game and just playing because I originally wanted to do like Fallout that's what I originally thought of and that's originally why I started up this channel I was going to just do that and that is these guys making that weird noise. I always forget what they sound like. But uh, I just wanted the parts of that Fallout that were fun. I didn't want to bother with the... I was going to do Fallout 3. And I still... I, I always still always think about it. Because I just started the game up. I found out how to get it to go again. And I just started it up again and I started playing a whole new game of it. I wasn't feeling too well. I, I like this weekend. I started. I started uh, playing Fallout Three again. And uh, wow, I forgot. I kept on. I forgot. How, you know, there's like stuff to it, and but I, I still think it's a great game. I still like it a lot. Um, I actually like it a tiny, I, I think I prefer it a tiny bit more than uh, New Vegas. No, it doesn't, that's just personal preference. I sort of like the story, basically, that's it. I think New Vegas is a better game, but uh, mechanics-wise. But the thing is, I had, I have such fond memories of, uh, of Fallout 3, because I modded it up, and I still have my old mods and everything. So I modded it up the way I wanted, you know. And I have all kinds of stuff on it, and, and I get it just the way I want, with different weapons and different stuff. So it feels like one of the things is it feels sort of I know when you're playing it that it feels somewhat it can feel somewhat empty, like the the way Capital Wasteland can feel somewhat empty. Like and when you're just running around until you get to a place. Like when you're in downtown DC or something like that, then there are a bunch of super mutants running around, all kinds of stuff going on. But uh, if um, you know, if you mod it up right, it doesn't. There's like a whole bunch of quests and things you could do. So there's like tons of stuff that's going on. You know, and it doesn't feel that bad. Also. I have a couple of weapons mods so that there's, well I have one weapons mod, a main weapons mod that makes it so that there's all kinds of different weapons so you're always looking for different weapons and, you know, um, like a weapons mod that not only has uh, weapons from the original Fallout 1 and 2, uh, they redid for Fallout 3, but um, it's like a weapons kit that will make it so that 
different weapons will have uh, scopes and stuff like that and silencers and so you constantly find different ones so you could constantly be looking for like uh, a silencer kit or a mod you know a scope kit or something like that like that to put on put on some of your weapons and all this type of thing you know it's just it's just fun you know You know, still okay. The only problem is, is sometimes it doesn't play well with the. Uh, it doesn't play nice with the <laughs> newer versions of Windows and stuff. Uh, not not Windows, just newer. Uh, it doesn't have the sort of smoothness that newer games have. The sort of uh, nice compatibility with like Windows, so that you could like Alt Tab on or something. Like if the game crashes, it'll hard crash. And. Uh, like once or twice this crashed on me where I just had to restart my computer, period. And uh it seems to take exclusive access to your computer, so it's like if I'm trying to listen to something in the background particularly I'll be listening to either a let's play or some ASMR. You know, and um I know that seems weird shooting stuff and running around and fall but li listening to ASMR but I do do it and like if you're running something like that it seems to not like it you know so if it crashes it'll like hard crash and not want to give you back access to the game so you have to like literally shut off your computer I, I can't even, uh, I literally can't even, um, control all deleted. I have to, you know, literally have to shut off the computer. I can't switch desktops or anything like that and try to get control over it. It just really hard crashes, freezes the game so that you can't get into it. Uh, I mean, that's so that you can't do anything about it. I find that some old games do that. Particularly, you know, if I'm doing stuff like, uh, you know, when I'm trying to like run something like, and just I'm talking about, I'm not, I'm not like running all kinds of crap uh, in the background. I'm just, I'm talking about just the browser. I mean, just I'm just running the browser so I could listen to like ASMR or something. I'm just on YouTube. It's a low, you know, I put it on like low, low and low bandwidth. I put it on the lowest resolution and just sit there and listen to them. Or I'll have my own playlist of stuff that I listen to. You know, and, uh, it, I mean, it doesn't happen, uh, it doesn't happen often. It's just, um, when it does, it's bad, you know. Well, I mean, it's not terrible. I just have to shut down my computer. I, I just have to restart my computer, and that's all. But that's sort of irritating. And, and of course, it happens. I I think it's mostly because of the mods and stuff. Because it, it does happen if you're running the game for a long time, you know. So, you know. Uh, it's sucking up a lot of resources and starts, you know, mods always do that. You have to always be careful of mods, you know. And it's not like the game was super stable in the first place, you know. It's never been, you know, and that's one thing about Bethesda games. They're not, they're not exactly, uh, not exactly bug free, if you know what I mean. And, you know, particularly Bethesda games, they're, they're known for being particularly crashy, you know, uh, buggy. Uh, let's move around a little bit here. I want to see what's going on. Wow, am I, am I really low? How low am I? 
I'm, oh, I'm on level 37, huh? Really? So that's probably the... This is probably that lava there. It's probably the bottom level lava. 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 <laughs> this is probably the low, low, low lava level. Yeah, 32. It'll be about 32, so... Oh, wow. You know what's sort of interesting? That hole over there. That hole over there. I'm just interested in what's going on down there. Wow, you know what? Alright, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I'm gonna go for it. I wanna try to see if I can get there. Let's put up a few extra blocks here. I wanna make sure I have a nice wide path. I don't want to suddenly get hit by something and knocked off the path. Oh, okay, let's take a look at this. I want to see what's down here. That's sort of interesting. Okay, let's move on. Oh, wow. Really, it goes... Oh, wow, well, okay. Now, wait a minute, I'm wondering... Okay, hold on. How far, how deep can I go here? Hmm. Before I hit lava. Okay. Oh, wow, that's sort of interesting. I thought, I really thought lava started at like level 32 and everything beneath that level I thought was, I always thought was, uh, not everything, but most was lava. Oh wow, okay, I'm on level 16 here. Okay, I'm, oh wow, that's weird. I wonder if I can go all the way down like level, you know, less than 10 or whatever. This, this is going to be sort of interesting. Let's check it this out. Uh, level 12. Okay. Level 10. Wow. All right. Let's go on. I don't think I've ever gone down to the, like, bottom level in the nether. I, well, I guess it's the same, right? I mean, you can't go below, below zero in this, right? No, there's no... Hold on. Well, wow, level six. Okay, there it is. There. Okay, there's the bottom. Okay, yeah, that's okay. Can I get rid of this stuff? I can't, right? Okay, that's weird. Okay. Wow, well, level four. Not so strange. I I knew. Okay, yeah. Level two. Wow. Can I get any lower than that? No, I don't think so. Can you? You can't go down to level one, can you? No, I don't think so. No. Okay. I just that's strange. I never. Okay. You know what? What? What if I go sideways? I wonder what happens. Uh, I want to see if... Uh, when am I going to start hitting lava? I mean, that's... Can I literally dig my way around? Underneath? Like, everything? Oh, wow. I wonder if I can. I wonder if I could dig underneath the lava. So that if I want to travel, I start digging, like, you know what I mean? Like, start... Come on. You know, and have like a tunnel system going underneath everything. So if I want to get somewhere, I could... Come on, hold on. Where am I going? Let me go to the... Uh... Okay, well, I guess I go... Let me check out east. This will be sort of interesting. I wonder if I can literally keep digging just beneath the surface. Oh, 
I must eventually hit. I'll eventually hit a lava thing, right? I mean, it must be. Wow. You know what? Maybe not. Maybe I could let. Maybe now that I'm below level ten or so, I could actually. Or maybe I'll make something, but maybe I'd go around it and pretty much keep a tunnel system going underneath the bottom here. That's wow. Of course, then I have to start climbing back, like, digging back up again. And that's when I'll probably get lava. That's sort of interesting. I literally didn't know you'd come, like, do this. Wow. I barely made it. I barely went from, oh, hold on, hold on, let me see how far this is away. This is, the gate one is, no, it's only like 200 blocks away, so, I, I guess I can't, oh well, this is 200 blocks away isn't that far, I mean, negative 200 to around zero. You have 250, it's about 250 blocks away. Huh. That's actually sort of interesting. I didn't I wonder if I could just keep digging over there, that'll be weird. Well, I'm getting the uh leather rack that I wanted, so Oh wow, you know what? I was supposed to keep the cobblestone because I <laughs> have to make instruments with those. Oh, uh, okay, so I guess I gotta go back and get more cobblestone. Alright, well, that's our experiment for the nether for right now. Uh, I actually want to come back and check this out. I want to see if I can uh, keep on digging across all the way to my other, uh, my other, other portal. That'll actually be, you know what, this will actually be a cheap way to get, to, get home. I could go through the portal in here. Run over to the, uh, it's not that far, I can run over to the gate over here, then go through the gate and get home. And be, be across, that'd be, that's, instead of going across the ocean, in a boat. I can just, I can just dig my way to my, uh, dig my way to freedom, I guess. <laughs> dig my way home. That'd be sort of funny. Oh, actually, you know what, because I'm... According to this, I'm pretty close to my, my portal's above me somewhere. Yeah, 35 meters up. So I wonder if I could just make a little uh, bridge going up here. Oh wait, there was lava near where I was, so right? So, well, still, you know what? Let me try it. Um, let me try that. Yeah, let me, okay, let me do this. Weird, creepy noises. No, don't do that. Don't make those way cat noises. Here we go, let's, let's see if this works. Let me see if I can... Let's see if I can do this. This would be sort of funny. Okay, let's uh, be careful here. Lava. I don't care about the roof bar. I don't want to just get up. Oh, that's what I, okay, good. Maybe I'm away from the lava enough. 
Okay, let me be careful from here, it looks like. I'm looking at the mini-map. See how it all turned orange there? Maybe if I get further enough away, a little bit further up, I won't hit the lava. It looks like the lava ends about... Yeah, okay. Take a little further up here. level is the gate at? Okay, I'm not actually sure. Let's... Okay, let's... Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, wow, that stuff breaks really easy, huh? It's 19 meters up. Was it that high up? I really didn't think it was. Okay. Well, let's, let's see. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm running out. Now, I break this stuff by hand. Oh wow, it's actually not that hard to break it by hand. I had no idea. Okay, let's do it. I, I, I think I can make it up. Uh, it's only a few meters, so 90 meters, whatever it wants, so... Let me see here. 12 meters. That's it. I, I think I can make it. It shouldn't be that bad. I should have made a double. I should have made a single step stay away. Let's have a double stay away. I'm sorry, you have to put up with this. <laughs> Bear with me. I'm getting up here. Okay, I just gotta be careful. I don't want a lava pouring on my head. <coughs> yep, okay. Okay, let me do this. Okay, yep, seven meters. Perfect. That should be close. Very close. Okay. Very good. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, that's it. Oh, there it is. Nice. <laughs> Not bad. Okay. It worked. All right. some more and get home here. Nice, no incidents, no nothing. I'm very happy about that. It's night time now, I'm gonna get inside real quick. Okay. You know what I am gonna do? I'm gonna do a little spelunking. While I'm waiting for this to cook up. Um, I'm gonna pick up some more, uh, more cobblestone and stuff. So let me do this. And. Hmm. What should I do with this stuff? Hold on. I'm getting the hiccups. Um, I'll put it here for right now. Maybe I'll do that as well. Yeah, okay. This stuff will go back to where it's supposed to be, okay. And iron. Okay, let me make 
take some iron blocks here. Okay, I hope this is a nice sort of relaxing evening. All right, nice relaxing lesson for you. I wasn't really in want of uh, just some relaxation. You know, I just to chill out recently. That's why I took some alone time and was like, I needed it. So I just wanted to sit there and just play something that I thought might be fun and just do nothing but that. That's what I did. So that's why I was playing like Fallout. I was not playing Fallout 3 again and all, all that. Where did I put the mushrooms? Right here? Or? No, I don't have any, I guess. I guess I put them here. No. Okay, well, usually I put them with the... No. I'll put them here. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's, you know what? I think I might just... Uh, I think I might go a little cave diving and start looking for stuff. Um... underneath back in that cave I was in. It was actually a lot of fun running around there. So maybe I'll do that next episode. I was having a blast just doing that, just running around the cave. I haven't done that in such a while. Yeah, I think I might do that next episode, so... Let me get some wood going here. Perfect. I'll have to switch my stuff back out, but... Okay, yeah, you know what? I think I'll do that next episode, so if you want to join me then, I'm going to run around the cave system a little bit, fight some horses, see if I can pick up some diamond, some more diamond. Uh, that should be fun. Just a tiny bit. Uh, not too much. Um, I do have a lot of the nether rack. But then again, it only makes blocks of 16, so I only have 32 nether brick. It's not a lot. Uh, maybe I might need a ton of this, though. What? Maybe, okay, maybe I'll run back and get some more nether brick and then nether rack and make nether brick. Because it's not going to make a lot. Now, the whole point was to make the houses at the town of nether brick, so. Yeah. Well, maybe I want to back. Maybe I'll do a little bit of splunking, and then maybe I'll run back to the Nether. I'll do one or the other first, and do the other one right afterwards. Actually, you know what? I'll get some other Nether brick, and then since I'm all outfitted for it, and then I'll do the splunking right afterwards. So. Let me make sure I have enough of this cobblestone going on. Okay. There. Actually, you know what's good that I don't have my extra pick because it'll when I run out of these, it'll it's a natural stop. It'll tell me to go back home, so I don't push it and get killed. So. Okay. Uh, thank you for joining me. I'll talk more a little bit more uh, next episode. So. Uh, please join me then. This bunny says, uh, thank you and goodbye for now.